So we've been talking all about fashion don'ts today and warning you how to avoid being too fashionable if it's harming your health. And we're here with health director for Red Book Magazine, Aaron Hobday, talking about our next topic, too tight jeans, also too tight belts. And here's, here's an issue. If you're trying to force yourself into your favorite pair of super skinny jeans, you could be compressing nerves, resulting in numbness, tingling in your legs. And That's all, not good. No, it's not. And we all do it. You've all been on that floor where you're trying to get those jeans up and you almost need, you know, a spoon to help you get into them. And, and, or the tight belts. I mean, the, the model doesn't need it here, but we're trying to hide those muffin tops and, you know, those tight underwear to make give us this type of figure. Right. But that's not good for And you. sometimes it's because the jeans are just way too tight. Yeah. Other times, maybe we could, you know, lose an inch around our waist, so you have some tips for us. Right. And we think that a common culprit could be bloating, and we know it's an important issue for women because belly bloat is a top search term on redbookmag.com. And so we came up with some solutions to help you beat the bloat so you can fit into your jeans and feel healthy and great. But the first one, unfortunately, is ditching those too tight clothes. If you're already bloated and then you force yourself into super tight jeans... It's it, a losing battle. Yeah, it compresses your abdomen, which then can make any digestive problems you're having even worse. The other thing to do, it's of course about what you eat. Oh. So we wanna say ditch the processed foods. When it comes to digesting things, your body has an easier time with whole foods like a potato as opposed to a potato chip. Mm -hmm. the, basically the rule of thumb is if it lasts a long time on the shelf, it's gonna last a long time in your stomach. <laughs> that's, that's a good point. <laughs> yeah, so another way to bust stress and beat bloat is to exercise. Oh. I That's mean, one more reason, we all know we're supposed to be exercising, and it can help keep things moving in your digestive tract, and mm -hmm. it can also reduce that stress, which can lead to bloating. Yes. Good tips. Thank you so much, Aaron. We appreciate it.